I'm so clean on my bitch and Celine. Me and Phillips sipping lean. This ain't no fuss. What's up, guys? Here to do a little bit of a review on the Fleece Cheetah Turbo, as well as show you guys what it sounds like, because we all know that's really important when you're picking a turbo. So when I was looking for this turbo, I didn't hear a lot of good sound clips. So what I wanted to do was kind of give you guys a review, as well as just a bunch of different sound clips. You can hear it all in one spot from the same truck with the same setup. I feel like also I have a pretty standard setup. First off, I'll just tell you a little bit about my build. It's a 1999 24-valve Cummins. It's got 150-horse injectors. It's got a four-inch straight pipe from the turbo back, big honking air filter, Quadzilla Adrenaline to do all the custom tuning on. If you're curious about any of those parts or any extra parts for your build, I do own a diesel performance company called Whitley Diesel Performance. If you shoot me a message, and I'll link all my socials and contact information below, but if you shoot me a message, let me know you guys are from the YouTube. I'll get you a really good deal. Really, whatever parts you're looking for, wheels, lift, tires, injectors, tuners, exhaust, turbos, for any truck, doesn't have to be a Cummins. So for this turbo, so far I've been loving it. It's been in my truck for about 2,000 miles now. Obviously the thing that everyone likes about these turbos is they're loud. And videos don't do it justice, they're loud. As soon as you start it up, you can hear it spool up. It sounds amazing. Even at idle, it sounds really, really good. I'll kind of add clips along this video and show you what I'm talking about. So here's a clip of me starting up the truck for the first time after the install. So as you can hear, pretty nice sounding turbo even at idle. Here's a couple clips of it free revving just at idle. So here's a clip of me going down a hill, just in gear, kind of coasting. I'll just go ahead and add in a couple of videos as well of it driving down the road, uh, and just random videos of where you can hear the turbo pretty well. So here's a uh, start up with the windows down. So overall rating of the turbo, I actually really like it. Um, not only does it sound incredible, um, but just overall great turbo. Really easy installation. It's a direct drop-in replacement, so you don't have to do any modification. As far as the performance of the turbo, like I said, I have 150 horse injectors in this truck, so I don't really feel any turbo lag at all. I don't think it would spool very well with stock injectors, but if you do have a tuner and you turn that all the way up, you might be able to spool it pretty good. With this turbo, I stay pretty cool on my EGTs. I was really impressed with how cool it was able to keep the truck. Still feel lots of that top end power that you're supposed to get from a stage four turbo. I haven't really towed with it much, so I can't talk to how it does towing. Everything I've read online says it's a fine towing turbo. But yeah, from Fleece, all the blades have Fleece Performance's logo just etched into it, which is just cool. The attention to detail on this turbo is really awesome. As soon as you start your truck up after that install, you're gonna be super happy with it, especially if you're straight piped. If you're not, delete that muffler, let that turbo sing. Whether you're going with this setup or a different setup, or you just want bigger injectors to spool this turbo better, or you already have this turbo and you want the exhaust to make it a little bit louder, Whatever your situation is, if you need diesel performance parts, hit me up. Like I said, I own Whitley Diesel Performance. Happy to give you guys a good discount for coming over from the YouTube. Message me, I'll link all my socials below. DM me and let me help you meet your performance goals for your truck. Thank you guys so much for watching my first YouTube video. I promise they'll get better from here. So clean, my bitch, it's a lean.